Hey guys, Tough Thumbs here. Just want to make a quick video. Uh, just because I took the day off today because I've been working myself too hard. And I'm starting to go crazy, so I you know, spent a day with my girlfriend. But I got a few things I did yesterday uh, that I still haven't shown. Um, you guys saw this military the other day. Uh, the titanium military with the carbon fiber scales. Uh, blade was stonewashed, as well as the pocket clip and the... Uh, the frame side. Also stonewashed uh, the regular titanium in case you want to put that on there. It won't look weird. So uh, you can see it's looking really nice. Bits and pieces of this crud on there from the stone washer, but I'm cleaning it up so. But uh, as you see it looking looking very nice. Still minorly sharp. Uh, next up for my friend Bill here, um, who just recently got his his uh, Strider pimped. Um, basically, yeah, I did a few scale for him. He loves this so much he wants to get rid of this one because uh, he thinks he's just never going to take it off there. Um, and this one he wants to sell. He started at 80, and uh, you'll know, see where it goes from there. So you guys can uh, PM me, and I'll I'll let you uh, you know I'll send you his email. Or whatever. And this one's OD green. The really nice grippy pattern on it. It's kind of like grooves. And uh, the OD uh, forest and jade uh, backspacer on it. Perfectly fits an SNG, so no problems there. I clean it up, get all the crud out of there. This thing's sweet though. Feels very nice in your hand, these grooves. So yeah, PM me if you guys want this. Uh, probably, you know, if none of you are, you know, biting, you know, drop the price. But, you know, we're starting at 80. So, just PM me on that one. And next up, the pimp job I got here is pretty damn sweet. As you can see here, you got the uh, the uh, Bradley what, Mayhem, I think it is. I don't know. One of the ballet songs. But this will be the second one I did this. And I have some fun with these things. I was actually talking to Exacto about him, uh, some ideas he was having about some of his uh, his uh, battle songs, but this one actually, you know, you know, I was allowed to go nuts on it, so I did, and uh, yeah, it looks pretty damn sweet. So we got the carbon, or not the carbon fiber, the red and black G10, and we got the kind of like the bamboo pattern going here at the bottom. Then we got some kind of crazy shit with some holes. And then you at the top you got the Anzo pattern. So you got triple triple patterns on here. And you got holes in each one and white spacer material. So it's got a nice, really sexy look to it. And this is definitely a new uh something I've never done before with these holes here. It's kind of like just nuts. Well, that's the last time I red and black. I've had this stuff uh, sitting around for a while. It's just not my favorite uh, G10, but as long as you put liner material on there, it's not nothing wrong with it. But uh, this one still needs a bit of little fixes here and there from the uh, pivot screws. Don't do the um, you know. There's no way to hold this side in place while you screw this side in. Yeah, so, you know, I'm putting the notch there. That one's polished up. I'm going to sandblast it so it'll look nice and even with the uh, blade and everything. I'm just going to do this side next. But I figured I'd show you guys just uh, so you had something. Because I'll probably get back to work tomorrow. But you see the lock works on here fine and everything. And, uh, yeah, it's got, it doesn't really need much more weight than there. It seems to flip fine, but uh, you know I'm not going to tempt anything because you guys laugh at me every time I do it. But I actually took this one to a knife shop today uh, to show my buddy who owns it, um, and they were they were loving the shit of it. The one guy said it was the coolest handle he's ever seen in his life, uh, especially in a battle song. He said, and I was like, thanks. But uh, yeah, they hadn't seen my work before, so I was pretty happy to show them. But I'm really happy with the way this one turned out. Pretty sweet. This is for T Munns, for Tyler, who likes to get stuff pimped and sell it. I know your game, man. I know what you're up to. I'm just joking. But uh, he seems like a pretty nice dude, so. I don't know how you work these things, but 
And all I know is this one looks real sexy, so. The thing I'm not quite getting is there's red G10 right there. And then the only color they sell for red is that ruby red. And this red is pretty bright. I'm not quite sure what's going on with that situation. I mean, if they can make it in tiger stripe, seems like they can make it in solid sheets. But they don't seem to do that. I'm not sure. So my one buddy wants some, like, Ferrari red liner material. And I really want to uh, satisfy uh, his his uh, custom dreams for his paramilitary, but there doesn't seem to be a material in existence that's like that Ferrari red for G10. So, but that looks like, a, this is pretty bright in person, like it, it doesn't look, it looks a little bit more washed out on camera, but the red and black is, the red's pretty bright for a G10. Not sure, but the red and white looks really cool there. It's very clean. Everything works fine. Locks nicely. I don't know if you get blade play in these things. I don't know. <laughs> but, uh, you know, my thoughts on this one was make it grippy. Because this, you know, I don't want someone having this slip out of their hands. And, you know, that these things just kind of are, you know, one step away from being like oil slicks. Freaking just sliding right off your freaking hand. So, I figure go with something super grippy. Get a little thicker. And uh, sorry, no music today, guys. I'm just making this video real quick because I'm still uh, chilling with my girlfriend today and I ducked out for a few minutes to uh, shoot some porno. So. Oh, those patterns actually line up. I didn't even notice that. That's pretty neat. So I was keeping the same tone on everything. Yeah, that looks sweet. Kind of line up together. Not perfectly, but almost there. This red is just very, very nice. Get the holes in there for weight issues because it's so damn heavy. Now this thing weighs nothing now, it's pretty crazy. But uh, but don't worry about the screws, man. They'll, they'll look really nice when I'm through with them. I just didn't feel like doing it right now. But uh, they'll be like nice and dull like that, but just with the uh, flathead. I can do the same to this side too, because there's not really much black on here besides these screws. It doesn't really go with the overall theme, but I don't know. It's up to you, man. So I'm going to cut myself or something. Open this the wrong way, like I just did. But, uh... God, I feel like eating some hot sauce with this battle song. Alright, guys, have a great night. Peace.